abarabu madu, abarabu madu, ocho bodo, dika inje jaya, aguna jamba, madu kibu maburu kwa mo, mo kibu maburu kwa madu, obozo kwa kibu wa... Who is that? Who is that that disturbs the peace of my consultation and meditation with the gods? Who? Abarabu Madu, Okrama Okrama Madu. It's me, Mokede. I've come to visit the gods of our land with my family. Show yourself to the gods. Thank you. Come, come. Sit here. Why are you backing the gods? Sit well. Sit down. You have to beware. How can a woman piss in my shrine with her legs? You want the wrath of the gods to fall on you? The gods know why you are here. You have come to inquire about his future. Too short a future and too gloomy his existence. But he was born great. Ah, Abaya, your message is not clear to us. Please explain. This child is destined to be great. But None of his family members shall enjoy his wealth. He shall be gone before you know it. This child will not live to be more than two and a half decades. Does that mean that he will die young? You have the interpretation. His wealth would lead to his death. Oh. Abara, please help. Please. Help. It is a curse on him by the gods. If he must live more than that, then he will die wretched. I want my son to live. We waited 12 years to have him. If he goes now, he may not have another. Abara, please. You are to come back in four days' time to appease the gods. Be gone before I change my mind, for I'm done with you. You disturb my consultation and meditation with the gods. Madoka, I bother about Mado. Don't know more great you. Ah, yeah, the great one, the wise one. That's me. I bother about Mado. The spirit man. That's me. The guardian of our destiny. You are right. This one, you are visiting my house at this time of the night. I must tell you, I am perplexed. Madoka. Yes. The frog does not hop in the afternoon. That's right. For nothing. That's right. Something terrible is about to happen. But you are the guardian of our destiny. So was it? A great child has been born, Madoka. Huh? A great child has been born in this community. A child whose star shines in the firmaments of this community. Mbano! Oh. Mbano, the great one! Abu Mado. Let his star not shine. He must die! This Mano. child was born great. With great luck and has success pursuing that child. Hey, Mbano, such a child must die. Remember, we made a covenant. Yes, the covenant. <laughs> so how do we achieve that? How? <laughs> what do you call me? 
honorable man, the greatest. The spirit man. Yes, the greatest one. Half spirit, half man. The wisest. I am the broken bottle that cannot be shooed. <laughs> it's an easy task, but it will cost money. Money? We're not talking about money here. We don't want that person's star to shine. Let him die. Look, I will foot the bill personally. Is it a deal? Yes, it uh, is. Will you bring it to the shrine or do I come to collect it? Uh, okay, I will bring the money to the shrine. I'll personally bring the money to the shrine. But be in charge, Amorabu Madu. Let your word be your bond. You don't have Leave my side to me. Maduka, you're in charge. Amorabu Madu, I'm not going to go. As the prayer warriors in this church, it is our duty to pray against every principality working against us. Yes. I hope you fasted as I instructed you. Yes. Stand up. Let us communicate with our God and the Spirit. In Jesus' name! Amen. Amen. The power of the Almighty God works in me. <laughs> I am not scared one bit by such challenges. Because I know that he that is in me is greater than the he that is in the world. We are victorious in Christ. Yes. And no weapon fashioned against us shall prosper in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Brethren, it is time to declare God's work and render the enemy powerless. Amen. We are not fighting against flesh and blood. We fight against principalities and powers of wickedness in high places. In Jesus' mighty name! Pray for me, Pastor Paul. Mm. Pastor Paul, who is Pastor Paul? Where, where does he stay? No, mm. I've sent for him. Oh, we have sent for him. Mm. Okay, mm. now nah. are you sure that's all you need? Yes, eh? mm. ah. Oh, there's a look at the door. Somebody's looking at the door. You don't. I learned your son is sick. Uh, yes. Where is he? He's inside. Let's go see him. My son needs your prayers. Mm -hmm. He wouldn't take his medicine. I don't know why. Maybe you can convince him to do so. Please. 
Sorry. I have come to pray for him. Mm. I believe in the power of God and not in the efficacy of your medicine. If he doesn't take his medicine, the sickness will get worse. That's for a carnal-minded person. You see, the Bible tells us that by the stripes mm. of our Lord Jesus Christ, we are healed. Mm. He died to keep us and make us enjoy good life. Who? Jesus Christ, the Son of God, the Savior of the whole universe. Pastor, I go to church too. I do. But this is not the time for preaching. Please, pray for him. Pray for him, Pastor, please. I have a meeting to attend. But I want us to talk about Jesus Christ. Pastor, I like the way you talk. But my time for the meeting is already gone. Please. Please, pray for my son, Biko. Biko, man. Biko. Hmm? In Jesus' name! Amen. They are a secret cult and not church. Yes. Mm. It baffles me when we call them church, 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 when all they know how to do is to create divisions amongst our people. Mm. Elders. God has given us wisdom. Why do we want to trade it for nothing? The man who brought the church into this village meant well. He meant development for this village. Look, look at our young people languishing in poverty. Look at our graduates roaming the streets without anything on the ground to show for it. Yet, in the face of all these, we have never bothered to find out what is wrong with us. It is the nature that is the problem. Yes. Ma'am, yes. it is the nature that is the problem. Yes, sir. Yes. 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 So we should eject them from this village. Mm -hmm. Obiora, whatever is the case, mm. let me tell you, whosoever beats the drums of war, must be prepared to dance with the warriors. <laughs> mm. The church has done nothing wrong. We know that your son is a member. Yes. Mm. Mm -hmm. So we won't be surprised if we wake up tomorrow and see him as a member. Mm -hmm. huh? mm, that's what By the way, why, why, why should I sit here, waste my time, discuss and plan evil against innocent people? Look, Whatever plans you are making, remember that no one is God. You can't just walk out like that. What happened to KK can happen to any one of us. Come back. Come back. I don't want to be a party to any evil plan against my people. No. The church has transformed the lives of the youth of this community. <laughs> Mr. Wokey! Do not, do not, do not, leave him to go now. Leave him, let, let, let him go. Since his mother died, Mr. Wokey has ceased to be a man. You know his mother used to be his backbone. A very strong native doctor in her own time. Mr. Wokey lost out everything. That is why he wants the church to stay. Like I told you, brothers. The letter from the headquarters said I've been posted to an, another station to continue the Lord's work. Oh, praise the Lord. Praise God. Amen. So when are you leaving, Pastor? Um, soon. It's going to be very soon. Pastor, but why, why now? This is when the church needs you most. No, 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 no. You don't need me. You see, you already have the anointing in you. I have planted and watered it, and the Holy Spirit is nurturing it. Yes, I know, Pastor, I know. But you see, this time around, there are lots of wolves roaring everywhere, looking for people to devour. Pastor, please, we need you. Don't be of little faith. I have taught you all you need to know. Remember, we are not given to the spirit of fear, 
or timidity. Be bold because your Father in heaven keeps watch over you. All their curses, all their pronouncements, you're free from them. You're the redeemed of the Lord because our Lord Jesus Christ has paid the price. Obiajula, you are to lead the youths. Don't worry. The Lord has chosen you. Just free your mind and let the Spirit of God take over. Pastor, I believe. But you see, I haven't led anyone before. How do I lead? The Lord will guide you. Always be prayerful. I will come from time to time to see how you're doing and how the church is growing. But you have to fast and pray. Seriously. You understand? Yes, yes. Pastor. Okay. So let's go. We're really going to miss you, Pastor. <laughs> I'll miss you more than you miss me. Mm -hmm. time I've had these dreams, they keep recurring. Did you uh, pray before going to bed? No, I forgot. But my Bible was under my pillow. The, the Bible has no power when it's under the pillow. It is only when you profess and declare the words inside of it that it becomes effective. Elevate yourself to the prayers. You see, when you become spiritually strong, this is when you lose the desire to satisfy anything in the flesh. And then no matter how tired you are, you can still pray. Prayer. Prayer is the weapon of warfare that we have. But Brother Sam, do you think these dreams have anything to do with my life? Prepare for a greater task ahead. Just try. Try as much as possible to fast. You will see the change in your life. You will. You see, the anointing that we have inside of us will then help it grow. Uh, what's it okay? What's it okay? What's it okay? What's it okay? No. Uh, I see our people. You are fine. Thank you. Okay. <coughs> We have come to see you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Won't you offer us chair? Yeah? Uh, yeah. I hope you have had a change of heart. Ah. We come for peace. Yes. yes. Udo? We are here for peace. Uh, yes. We come for peace. Abia Gaili? Abia Gaili? Uriako. Bring seats for these uh, people. <laughs> Master, okay. Yes. Teacher, you're welcome. Uh, hey, thank you. Put the way to I know the way one time. Okay. Mm. <laughs> okay. I hear your name. No. You know why we are here. Unless you tell me. Okay. Um, I was short of words when I heard what happened last time. I see. I see. I believe we all can differentiate between our generation and the modern times. Things have changed. And we must change too. Let us remake 
this community. Mm. Moked, let us not start this argument again. Mm -hmm. The elders have decided that the, the new church must go. Yes. yes. They make our gods angry. Yes. And that is why our people are not progressing. Yes. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. I see. Yes. The elders are being influenced by what I know not. Mm? Mm. We have a short time to live. None of us here will live for more than three decades. We must find a way of solving the problems in this community. Mm. For the first time in the life of this village, a young man bought a car, except Onwa himself. Is he a member of that church? Yes, of course! Bring him for a scholarship. Wait, wait, let me see what I can what I have for you. Oh God bless you. God bless you, whichever millie. God bless you. Alright, use this, eh? Hey! Let me get this one. Let me alone. Come to the house. Hey, God son. bless you, Oma. I'll do something for you. Hey, I want this village as well. Oma! Oma, I'll see Omwa. you with your son. Scholarship, yes. eh? Yes, sir. Scholarship Thank for you. him. God bless you. God bless you, Oma. Thank you. Oma, I don't wear. Bye bye. Hey! Um, John. We have to go and see Obiajulu before we go home, alright? So drive straight to Obiajulu's house. to wait for Brother Obi Ajumu. He actually told me he will be here today. So how far have you gone with the handbills? I collected some today, but um, some are still remaining. Some? About how much do we have left with the printer? 100 copies. 100 copies. 100 copies. But you know, Brother Chukuri, that we cannot afford to lose that much souls. So no matter what it will take, we must get those number of copies left. But um, we are still owing the printer. How much are we owing the printer? 2,000 naira. 2,000 naira. Uh, well, uh, you have to go to uh, Sister Anita, all right? You know she's a new treasurer, all right? I will ask her to give you the sum of 2,000. Uh, Sister Anita. Please, you have to give Bro Chupu the, uh, the sum of 2,000 uh, to enable him to collect the remaining uh, number of uh, handbills. Okay. Uh, when will you need the money? I'll need it tomorrow. Tomorrow? Okay, I'll get it for you. Okay. You see, because um, we really need to collect this thing so we can reach out to the people in the community. It is important they get to know 
how important it is to embrace God. Am I talking to people? Yes. You understand what I'm talking about? Yes. Good day. Good. Good day. Where is the pastor? Which one of them? The pastor that uh, prayed for my son, Obi Achulu. Oh, oh. Sir, please, sir. Please, come on. Come on, come on. Sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down, please. You're welcome. Thank you. You see, actually, um, the pastor you're looking for is no longer here. He has been transferred to another church of ours in some other village. But is there anything you want the Lord to do for you? I want to see him. I am the new pastor in charge here. Tell me whatever the problem is. I want you to come to the house first thing tomorrow morning with the report of expenditure and the total income realized for the company during my absence to Europe. Okay? Yes, sir. I will, sir. Good. And uh, Emma, sir, how are you getting used to our procedure here? Oh, everything is okay, sir. I hope you are picking up. Yes, sir. Let's see. Um, how is about your family? No, they are all fine, sir. Huh? They are all fine, sir. Okay, I will make our time to come and see them, okay? That's all right, sir. Good. And uh, you, we won't forget to come tomorrow. All right. You have to do something to twirl their plans or they will overpower you. Not when the Lord Jesus Christ is with me. I know the former pastor was a very, very strong man in the Lord. I don't know about you. But if you are, fight the tree God or they will use it against you. Anointing. The anointing of our Lord Jesus Christ is the same everywhere. You can even get the same anointing. You see, God has brought us here to liberate the people of this community. That's why we're here. This is not a child's play. This is not a child's play. The elders are very serious. They are against you and we want to evict you from here. <laughs> God has brought you here for a purpose. Make this your turning point. Because our Lord Jesus Christ died on the cross of Calvary for you and for me to be free. They will come after me. I know it. They will. Make this your opportunity, sir. Because condemnation is not for anybody that runs to Christ. You have run to Christ. You have come into the house of God. God will surely protect you. No matter what. He will surely protect you. For says the Lord. I have come. Praise God. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise the living God. Hallelujah. Get up, I'll pray for you. Huh? Kneel down. Praise the Lord.
These church people have turned and say, okay, do Don't don't leave him. He knows what he's doing. But he can't last more than his expectations. Obiora, hmm? that man is a traitor. I know that from the start. I know that. What is that fool doing? He's coming to us. Coming to who? Uh, to us. How stop him? Ah, ah, Donna, Donna. Let him. Let him come. Come back. Come and sit down. Come, come and see what the Lord has done. Come and see. Come and see. Ah, Obiora. Take, take, take. Even you, Donna. Look, we have a program at the church. Come and see the work of God there. Is it wicked? Is it wicked? How can you still be a fool at your age? Yes. Huh? Huh? Is it wicked? Where are those charms? I will have a made for you. Yes. Where are the charms? After eating at the table of Abara Uku, the man go and Bakuru, Manyaru, Zuzuru, join those uh 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 Akraka. Uh, 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 get away. Why? Go. May the Lord have mercy on your soul. Akere tapia kwa anya. Udele. Ne ne otula. Kinge na ame ame. Is the brothers and sisters? I tell you. Today is a great day. Yes. Today is a great day. Yes. Because we have come to fight the devil. Oh, yes. Because we have come to fight the devil. Oh, yes. My brothers and sisters, put on your armor of God. Put on your armor of God. For the battle has just begun. Yes. The battle has just begun, I said. The battle has just begun. Yes, Brother Wicked, go in. We're waiting. Go! For the Lord is with you. Push, Bushkin is in the Whatever this is, wherever you came from, we destroy you by fire. fire. Whatever this is, we destroy you by fire. Whatever this come from, we destroy you by fire. Whatever this came from, we destroy you. For the Bible tells us that whatever we cast and bind on earth is cast and bound in heaven. Whatever we put away here on earth is put away in heaven. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Holy Ghost. Fire. Holy Ghost. Fire. Our God is a God of fire. Yes, Lord. Our God is a God of fire. Our God is a God of fire. We shall burn and destroy. Amen. Amen. We shall burn and destroy. Amen. 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 For Lord, the Lord says that in the measure of His name, every knee shall bow yes, and yes. every tongue must confess yes. that Jesus is Lord. Yes. Yes. That Jesus is Lord. Yes, yes Lord. Lord. Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, the answer is by fire. Who will be my God? Hello, Um, I'll read a little verse for you from the Bible. The Bible tells us in uh, Matthew chapter 6 verse uh, 24 that no one can serve two masters at the same time. You will either hate one and love the other or you'll be devoted to one and despise the other. You cannot serve God and serve mammon at the same time. Brother Wokedi, what you have just seen this night is the handiwork of God. Amen. All right? God has just destroyed everything that is not of Him. All things have passed away. All right? 
That is what the Bible tells us. Believe you now. Uh, Oli, uh, sit down. Papa, what is sit happening? Down. What is happening? Uh, Brother Sam, I'm sorry I wasn't there for the outreach. It's okay. God was good. So, Papa, what's happening? Um, well, we are celebrating. Celebrating what? <laughs> I'm born again! <laughs> You're born again? Born again! Uh, brother, you, Papa, is born again? <laughs> yes. Brother Sam, yes. is it true? You just heard him. I don't, Papa, you're born again. I am born again. Glory, hallelujah! Amen. Amen. This, is, this is wonderful news. This is beautiful news. Amen. Amen. You know, as I was telling you, yes, before I'm standing in the Bible, yes. I was a member of a powerful cult mm. who brought the tree god down to this village. Don't come there. My people, we have examined all the happenings in the community and by the contacts and consultations made with Ndins and Ozo, it is agreed that we bring the tree guard to protect our people. We hear the tree guard is a very powerful guard. That was my earlier suggestion. What about our council? Oh, the council still remains supreme and its decisions will be binding on all. Who and who will take care of the God? Abalabu Madu will. Even though he's the youngest, he's the highest in rank. Any objections? Any objections? Then let it be as suggested. Who am I to question the decision of the council? As the gods have spoken, so let it be. Hooray, 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 hooray. Maduka, you look tensed up and worried. Don't back the ghost. What is the problem? Speak, speak, my favored one. I am here because of the deliberation. What about the deliberation? Yes, the tree god. Mm -hmm. It comes from Wokedi's extended family from Umodia. Mm -hmm. Yes. I want us to have full control of it. He may use it against us. Why? Hey, I know what he did too well. He may use it against us. Uh, I, well, what are you really implying? I don't understand. Okay, if we can have the control of the gods, then it will increase your influence and no native doctor will stand you. What is in it for you? What more? Uh, if not prospering me, you know, if not making me more prosperous, <laughs> let me tell you what you don't know. Other members of the fraternity wants to eat you out. Huh? Yes, so this is our chance. This is our chance. What about what? If you want it, if you can finance it, then I'll do it. Okay. I'll find a way to do it. I don't mind. I'm going to finance it. I don't mind selling my family land to foot the bill. But on one condition. I'm what, gonna, condition? Gonna what condition? What uh, condition? You know now, uh, all the riches of the community will belong to me. Riches of the community? Yes, Abra. What of me? What happens to me? Uh, Abra, 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 Abra. You, you, you will become the most powerful native doctor this community has ever produced. Yes, and people from far and near will be coming to seek your help, your assistance. Is that all? That's it. Uh, okay. I'll, I'll give you my first daughter to marry. Ifoma. I'm my first Ifoma, daughter. your beautiful I'll... daughter? Yes. I'll... As my wife? Mom. But this bond must not be broken. <laughs> you have spoken well. In fact, it is a deal. Just do your part. Yes. Do your part. 
and leave the rest to me. It's a deal, Maduka. The gods have had you. Amaruku has had you. <laughs> Let's see. Great friends. Amaruku, the great one. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. There's another verse in the Bible. Um, brother, uh, brother, okay. please uh, open, uh, open to um, uh, Second Corinthians uh, chapter five, verse seventeen. Please, I love that verse. Please go. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has passed away. Behold, the new has come. Did you hear that? If any man be in Christ, the moment you accept Christ as your Lord and personal Savior, Wait. the old, everything you have done in the past, your 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 cultism, your juju, your witch, your wizardry, everything is now in the past. <laughs> The new church is going to our shrine to destroy it. The chief in council said that we should go and stop them. Avaruku is the protector of our land, the great God. There is no other God but Avaruku. Don't listen to those idiots, those bastards that claim to go to church. Fire! 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 that bothers me about you and I keep wondering what is happening you see you are more of a, a son to me you know but I have watched you over a period of time and I haven't seen you know tangible improvement I haven't seen any improvement in your life and it's bothering me and I ask why 
Is there anything the matter? Sir, uh, I really don't know. You see, I've been saving money for marriage and a lot of things, but something always comes up and disrupts my plan. I see. But you should have let me know what your worries are. You never told me you had any problem. Anyway, I want you to save towards that. And um, I think I will have to increase uh, the salary. Would I give you a leverage? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Very good. Um, I heard that um, I had what happened yesterday. I have not known your father to be that fanatic. I had what happened yesterday. I don't know why he should get himself involved in such thing. I never knew him as to be that fanatic. Please, I want you to advise him. Tell him that he is too old for such involvement. That young church people he's getting involved with, you don't like it. I think he is too old to join that uh, church. I mean, young people that is in church. I'm advising him. Huh? Please do. Huh? He is too old for such a thing. I don't see him uh, attending th th those new churches for what? Um, anyway, uh, when you see any lady of your choice, hmm? do not hesitate to let me know. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. I'll get you that word. Huh? Okay. Let me see Chief Donald. I'll be back soon. Obi Ajolo, come, come and keep me company. Come, come, come that way. Let's go together. See, I want you to be following everything I do, okay? I <laughs> Doc, that swallow stone will surely pass it out. An angry copra, that swallow's needle, does it at some risk. The raging fire has no mercy for the forest. You are my son. You are my pride. I am making visible. You are indestructible. You are like air. You go to wherever you want to. May the gods of fire, the gods of smoke, guide. Um, Samuel, you are from this village. And um, you live here too. So you know how our people behave. Mm. Why is your church so militant as to fight our own people? Why? <laughs> uh, Chief, yes. militant is not the word. But I think that the war that is going on is for the sake of our people. That's the way I look at it. <laughs> there is no war at all. And there shouldn't be any. Worship in your church like others. I thought you should know that the uh, church is not made for war. Um, Mr. Chief, I think that tree is actually the cause of the problems in this community. And I cannot, as a man of God, watch my people suffer without saying anything about it. <laughs> That's some. You are not the first person ever to preach in this uh, community. Alright? Fighting war will not make my people turn to your God. So I want you to think about it. Hmm? Let my people practice their own belief. Okay? Anyway, um... That's not the issue why I brought you home. I learned that your church is fast growing. Yeah, glory be to God. Yeah. So come in. 
So I said I should um, find you some money. I mapped out some money for your church. of Mwaked. You brought the covenant we made. The covenant is not binding on me anymore. Your stubbornness cannot help you. I decree death on you for exposing us so much guided secrets. Your decree is only the beginning of my life. You cannot touch my soul, let alone destroy it. I am still your superior. Mwokaidi, you are doomed. This is your end. I must have to apologize for keeping you waiting. Uh, it wasn't intentional. Uh, some of my business colleagues are right now in my city. Ah. So I have to tidy up one of the Chief, thank you very much. Yeah. There's no problem, Chief. Yeah. We know how busy you usually are. Yeah. So we are patient. You're welcome. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. 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 I have few questions that has been bothering me. Few questions that have been bothering my heart. Uh, one is, I want to ask the elders, has the girls deserted our land? I don't think What is happening to our community? Huh? How think? can we, the elders of the land, sit down and fool the hands watching this young generation mm. this young people sweep our gods mm. do we have to do that mm. chief that is why we have come what's happening in our village has never happened in the past terrible when a man take, takes the responsibilities of the gods the gods will never fold their hands and watch. Rather than we smite him. That's right. That's what happened to Wokedi. I spoke to him earlier, but he wouldn't listen to me. Mm -hmm. Yes. Wokedi. Hey. Hmm. Huh? I heard that he went to challenge the three god. He and even god. went to cut it down. And the gods smote him. him. Uh -huh. Is he dead? Yes. <clears throat> Nobody plays with the gods. Uh, uh, oh, okay. Huh? 
Why did you choose to fight the gods of the land? Mm. Chief, the Which keepers one? of the three gods mm. say that the gods want to be appeased for the desecration of their shrine. Oh. Oh. And the uh. gods are annoyed with this village. Yes. Uh -huh. This is the right thing. Why yes. would gods be annoyed? Mm. Why? Now, what is required of us to appease the gods of the land? What do we do? Donangwa. <coughs> Chief, here is the list of the items needed for the sacrifice. Mm. Mm, I see. And the presence of the people is also there. Mm -hmm. Now, who undertakes the sacrifice? Um, who takes charge of the sacrifice? The Council of Wizards. Oh, the Council of Wizards. Yes. Then in that case, we have solved the problem. Because I've already sent words to them. Oh. Yes. Let it be done. Yes. Let it be done, the elders of a land. Yes. That tree is my life. So it is our strong. Um, 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 open. Um, um, open. Very good. Most of our members are absent. They took permission from me. Others were sent on errand by me. You can sit down. <clears throat> so, what is the issue at hand, Nebul and Apunau? I have been disturbed. What is the problem? The three gods. What about the three gods? Umokai did paid with his blood. His blood was not accepted. How can you say so? I decree his death and I imprison his soul. He is only asleep. His soul was untouched. Unless we perform the sacrifice, we stand the risk of losing our powers. <laughs> and where will that be? When we unite. I have been betrayed once. I will not give you the second chance. Who are you to walk out on me? Come back! You broke the bond of the Brotherhood by spilling the blood of a member of the Brotherhood. Is a traitor just like you. I will not participate in his sacrifice. I have nothing to do with the three gods. My power can fight anyone. Huh? Abar you have disappointed us. Go and appease your god and not ours. Go, Abar Barukule, tu kwai poro no toto ba yu borisa o zanyu borisa. Abarukule, 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 abaruku. The great God that I call seven times and He answers me. Abarukule, abarukule, abaruku. The great God. We have come to rededicate the souls of the people of this village to you. We want power. We want Maduka to continue to have success. And I want more powers. And we are asking you to give us strength as we call on them to come forth, that they will come. We call on the souls of the sons of this village to come here for rededication. Come! 
comfort. Il est malé au lé, il see myself in strange places doing strange things. Like what? Like I'll see myself in chains and I can't move. Other times I see dogs chasing me and I can't outrun them, you know? Then I see myself tied to a tree and I can't move as if I'm a goat or something. Then the other one, the most recent one, I was in this deep pit about 10 feet down and I, I, I couldn't come out. I don't, know, I don't know what to do about it. I don't understand what is happening. I've always told you to take things of God serious. But rather than stay at home, than coming to prayer meetings. In fact, we really need to see Brother Sam immediately. Brother Sam? Yes, now for counseling. If I get within 10 feet of Brother Sam, he'll start talking about this youth leader issue. Listen, you had better see him. Tell him and pray with him. I will, I will. But first, I have to say Anita. Sister Anita, there are some things we have to discuss. You. Great one, I bring another sacrifice to you because it is your food. One cannot dine and wine with you and claim to be celebrating in heaven. And those who eat from your table are yours as gifts. I send your spirit to dominate them that have drawn from your well. The church has drunk from your cup. Mm. Mm. That was nice. Did you enjoy it? Yeah. <laughs> I made it specially for you. Okay. So, mm. did you get the money? Um, I'm sorry. They've not paid me for the month. <laughs> Is that all you can say? <sighs> Obi, please, uh, I want you to try and understand. No, I it's don't... you who does not understand. Look, I need 20,000 Naira to do the right thing for once in my life. 
20,000 naira and I won't beg anymore. So, what do you expect me to do? You're the church treasurer. Uh, no, right? no, 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 please. Please, Obi. No, not again. Please. See, I have given you 60,000 naira from the church post. I can't do it again. Honey, trust me. Whatever happens, you're not going to regret this. Okay? I need 20,000 naira to float a business with someone. Please. So you came to see me today? Oh yes, I decided to come and see because you asked me to wait and I waited. I couldn't see you. I am sorry. I, I went to see my in-laws. I'm really sorry. Please, can we go inside? Uh, how about your family? They are inside. Uh, I thought you dressed to go out. Uh, that is true, but uh, you know the proverb? You sell the ban when you see something greater than the farm. <laughs> You and this your wife say. Oh, wow. <laughs> All right, in that case, yeah. I prefer us to talk outside. Ah, mm. Yes, you know, no uh, uh, let's talk outside. Mm. And, and uh, quickly, mm. I heard that uh, these church people are at it again. Oh, that they want to visit the three gods again. It is not a rumor, chief. And they are planning a crusade to win more converts. What? Uh, uh, and if they win more converts and outnumber us, that is the real problem. What are we doing? Can we fool our hands like this and keep quiet, watching them to destroy our gods? Chief, you know I can't do anything alone. I need the support of the youths. The youths? Yeah. Well, what will it take for the youths to, 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 to join them? Eh? Let us get the youths mobilized. Eh? What will it take? If we have something like uh, 20,000. 20,000 uh, uh, John, get me my briefcase. I am going to give you 40,000 naira. What about the money? Um, I have it here. What? How can you carry around such an amount of money? Well, the church organizing committee needed it for some planning for the uh, crusade. So I promised I was going to get it for them. And what are you going to do about them? What will they do? <laughs> Tomorrow is another day. Yeah, I can always give each of them tomorrow. Okay. I wonder what I'll do without you. <laughs> can I have it? Yeah, let me get it for you.
sorry, I stopped on the way to check on somebody. I was coming with brother, brother Obi Ajulu, but he stopped on the way to collect something from Praise the Lord! Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Praise the Lord! Hallelujah! Because God, God is about to do a great and mighty thing here today! Yes, Can I hear it? so-called new church will leave this village. That's why we sent for you. 
Yes. They even plan to hold their crusade on the day of a masquerade ah. festival. Mm. Uh -huh. And what did the elder say about it? We want you to do, do something. Yes. We want you people to do something. Yes. Just leave everything to us. Hmm? We are to the task. <laughs> Do you need anything to arrange your boys? Okudere <laughs> 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 went to his maternal home. Uh. He said we should give you this. Wabara. I am Wabara, the son of Aponawu, the servant of the great God, Abaruku. Just leave everything to us. Wabara, 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 Obi Ajolo Obi Ajolo Let's go How are you? Friends Are you sure you're alright? I'm alright I see um, Obi Have you found the wife? Yes, sir. Uh, there's this lady I met, uh, and I think she's okay. You think? Look, I don't like that language, think. Now, please come. Come and sit down. Sir? Come and sit down. Sit down. You see? We'll be alone. I don't like this your idea of uh, thinking. Each time I ask you about getting a wife, what are you thinking of? Huh? Listen, uh, I, I want you to get a wife of your own choice. Then I will foot the bill. Sir. I've even also arranged a place where you two live. Sir, yeah. I just want time to organize my life, sir. I can't understand language. What sort of language is that? I've told you I am going to do everything for you, so huh? you don't know how close your late father is to me. Hmm? So I just want to start something, have some money in my account before I can think of marriage. Okay, okay. I now know where you're coming from. Want me to increase your salary? Not actually, sir. You see, I... I just want to stabilize my life first before I can think of marriage. I see. Um, have you arranged all that I need to travel with? Yes, sir. You know those traveling documents? Yes, sir. Then your briefcase, sir. Good. Go and give me that briefcase. Uh, Obi! Sir? Please come. Um, I heard that you have uh, started attending that new church, is it true? But sir, uh, it's only a church now. No, no. You see, Ubi, not all that call themselves church are church. Eh? I don't want you to start mingling with those refraps. I mean, they are all non-entities. They don't know what to, how to make use of their time. And besides, you begin to attend all these meetings. What time will you have to oversee our factory? My factory, your own factory. Your father is a very good, good friend of mine. Hmm? So get me my suitcase. For so long I have walked, yet there is nothing to show for it. I know I try my best, 
I get paid on time and most often with bonuses. But I can't boast of more than 10,000 Naira in my account. My mates have cars, even though they are not well paid like me. Could it be my father's story is true? But Chief pays me well. He tries to make me comfortable. His idea of getting married is not such a bad one. After all, Chief is such a nice person. I'll find a wife, just like he said. Chief treats me well, like a son. I will find a wife. I will. sisters, the Bible tells us that without holiness, no man shall see God. That same Bible tells us that no matter what we do, we must aspire to be holy. my son. You are now invisible, untouchable, you are now impregnable, indestructible. <laughs> Go well, my son. Let's 
to my place in such manner. Are you a fool? Are you insane? Speak. Or I'll be caused. Your son, Wabara. My son. Uh, uh, what about my son? He's born in you know. Where? Near the church. Hey! hey. Oh. was my only surviving son. I loved him. And he died fighting our war. What do you want the council to do about it? It's an open war. Defeat for one means defeat for all. I have nothing against you. But don't you think this is not our war? Remember the brotherhood. It is not for me, but for everyone. I pledge my unlimited support to fighting those who inflicted these pains on you. What do you want from the council? This is the second time I am asking this question. I want the Supreme Council to decree death on whoever killed my son. I want us to gather forces together to fight our enemies. It could be any of us next. Please, what kind of magical powers do they use? I hear they are a church. They are not. They have come to take over our territory. And I'm ready to fight them with my last blood. Don't dare to fight anyone until you make peace with the council. You shed the blood of a member of this council and you have not made peace. And does that mean the council will not do anything about this? Absolutely not. Then I do the fighting alone. Up now. Up now. Up now. Up now. There are two people here amongst us. A man and a woman. They have a confession to make. I will now call upon uh, Brother Obi Ajilo and Sister Anita. Praise the Lord! against God and the church by living a very hypocritical life. But it says in the Bible that when you repent of your sins and confess them to God and the church, you shall be forgiven. So we stand before you and confess to the sin of fornication. Mm. Hey. Yeah. 
my brother Biagela has said, we have sinned against God and we ask for his divine forgiveness. no place in the kingdom of God and no weapon fashioned against the children of God shall ever prosper. In the name of Jesus Christ I rebuke you agent of Satan and I say to you our heads shall never ever anchor to any evil thing. In the name of Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Anointed by God, touch not the apple of God's eye. How dare you challenge my authority? How dare you? You are my prisoner. My prisoner, you will remain forever. Whomsoever the Son of Man shall set free is free indeed. I am free. Come back here! Okay, come back here! You are my captive! <laughs> Possess this land. Yeah. We must possess this land. Yeah. 
And we have possessed this land. Because anything that is not of God shall go down. Thank you, Jesus. There's a problem. There's a problem. Big problem. What is the problem? Big problem within the community. What is the problem? Hey, these people are now becoming stronger and stronger, mightier and mightier. What? With what? Abra, Abra. You mean this church will? Hey. <laughs> yes. Is that why you're shaking? Abra. Is that why you're trembling? Abaruku will be will come to our rescue. Yes. We have a God that can protect us. Do, do not worry. I shall bring them before us now and know what they're trying to do. Please. Let, Let me, me see. see. What, what the, the enemy, enemy has in mind as I, I conjure them to appear. Yes. That is how we dedicated this what? town to Abaruku. Until that shrine is broken or destroyed, this town shall never prosper. Can I hear you say amen? amen. We shall go there and destroy that shrine physically. Bible tells us that any day a soul is born unto his fold, there is joy in heaven. Yeah. Where are the prayer warriors? Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. With our confession, we will shout him straight to the shrine and destroy the shrine physically. Yeah. We shall go to the shrine and destroy it physically. Amen. Hallelujah. Yeah. What is that Panao doing with them? Hey. Hmm? Oh. Oh. Ha! This is fire for fire. They shall meet me here. Abra. 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 Abra, do something. Maduka. Abra. Maduka, come back here. Ha ha. Oh, ele ele ma ele This is a confession of the gods. We shall know between the two turtles which one is male and which one is female. The great God, Awaruku, it is time for war, time for battle. I call on you to come forth in the form of smoke and consume all your enemies. Those who clap their hands in churches and claim to serve one God. I don't want to pronounce his name, for his name is abomination before me. And I call on you, Abaruku, send forth your fire to consume them and consume their gods. <laughs> Pull it down! Stand back, Abaruku! 
Disappoint you again. I won't. There will be no second chance. Like I told you back in the house, yes. I intend to marry. Ah, praise God. You see, the Bible says that he who decided to go wise, but it's a good thing. I think we're decided on the heart. Eh? So who is she? Oh, Anita! Hey, it's good! <laughs> so how far have you gone with the arrangements? Well, my family met her family and a date has been fixed. And I want everybody in church to be there. Oh, yeah? You can count on me. Anita, my daughter, you are looking beautiful. Today is your day. Please hurry up, eh? Ah, thank you. Try. Hey, Mama, please. Help me get my powder. It's on the table. Thank you. Mama, have you seen it? Please help me get the powder. Mama, I don't know where it is. Mama, please, I'll come to Hurry up. Hurry up. Brothers and sisters, it is a thing of joy to preside over this wedding ceremony this afternoon. After assuming office as your new pastor two weeks ago,
When I came in this morning here, I felt some spirit of evil forces around us. And for that reason, I will call on the church to pray for these young couples. In the name of Jesus.
For we fight not against flesh and blood But against principalities and powers And wickedness in high places So we must put on the full armor of God So we can withstand 